As SoCal COVID-19 case numbers keep rising, more people are worried they could catch it. Of course, and CBS 2's Tina Patel, she's actually live in Encino at a testing site with the latest on this. Good morning. Well, health officials say that the number or the rate of people testing positive is rising, and so is the number of people being hospitalized near peak pandemic levels. And that is why many people are getting concerned. Take a look at this new poll just released by the California Healthcare Foundation. They found more than three quarters of Californians are concerned that they will contract COVID-19 or someone in their family will. And the numbers are even higher when you look at different races and incomes. 85% of Latinos who are getting infected at a disproportionately high rate are concerned. 90% of Asians concerned. Let's take a look at some of the other questions that were asked. 53% of Californians now say shelter in place orders are being relaxed too quickly. When the same question was asked three weeks ago, only 43% of people said that. So attitudes on reopening are changing. And unfortunately, only 57% of people polled say they think our state is prepared for another wave of COVID-19 cases. Now look at this video because there is another problem we're seeing in the Inland Empire. Health investigators are reaching out to people who have tested positive, trying to find out where they've gone recently so they can do contact tracing and determine if other people might have been unknowingly affected. But some people are saying that they can't recall their whereabouts. Others are not cooperating, saying they feel like it's an invasion of privacy and they don't trust giving personal information to the government. So back out here live, health officials say they will work on continuing to educate people, letting them know about the importance of testing and contact tracing so health officials know where this virus is. We'll send it back to you in the studio.